Girl, I'm glad we caught the late movies. It gave me a chance to get out of my clothes. Yeah, I know. Me a chance to do your hair. Girl, it was so hot in there, I with my curls out. I see. Well, I know you're hungry because you're eating for two now. <laughs> you know I am. So what do you want to eat? My treat? My mom brought us some groceries, so I was just going to wait till we got home. Okay, well, it's cool. Well, we need to hurry up and get home. I know, right? Well, that sure was a great movie. <sighs> sure was. It sure helped me take my mind off the train. Hey, Jada, did we park over here? Let's go this way. No, I don't think so. I think we parked over here. Hold up, let me get my keys. I told you we should have went the other way. Hi, Jada. Don't be speaking to us. We don't talk to you like that. Trey, I can't believe you. You lied. Lied? Lied about what? Hey, you told me you wasn't seeing anyone. No, I wasn't when you asked. Mm -hmm. That's a man for you. How would you know? You never had no one. And I'm glad, especially if he anything like your sorry, bud. Trey isn't sorry. She shouldn't have tried to get pregnant thought that was going to keep them. She didn't try. She is pregnant. Who asked you anything anyway? Is that what he told you? I tried to get pregnant? Yeah. You dummy. Whether she tried to or not, you know I ain't want no baby. Well, whether you want one or not, slow bunny, you're finna have one. He said it might not be his anyway. Shut up, Trisha. Yeah, shut up. I don't care what he said. It's his baby and I'm keeping it. Switch yourself. I want a part of it. Baby, can we go now? The movie is about to start. And you know how I hate being late for the movies. Yeah, Trey, you know how she hates being late for the movies. You didn't even take me to the movies. We would always have to sit at your house. Yeah, because you said we didn't have to go nowhere if I didn't want to. So I didn't want to. Look, girl, let's go. I ain't got time for this. I'm hungry. You better take that girl back home. Back to the purple ribbon where she be flipping burgers. It's the blue ribbon. We don't be flipping the burgers. It's a fancy restaurant. Oops, I forgot. You and us, since you ain't never been to one. And baby, I don't think she worked there anymore. I thought I saw her at Bob's restaurant. No, I don't. And yes, you did. What you doing watching me play anyway? Well, whatever it is, you need to get your girl a job so she can support that baby, because I'm not. Trey, I don't need you to help me take care of my baby. Because this mystery man told me that my baby belongs here, and that God has a purpose and a plan for our lives. So I'm going to make it with or without you. Yeah, boy, that's right. With or without you. You need to get on my face. Oh, whoa, well, what you going to do, huh? What, what, what you going to do? Nothing. That's what I thought. Let's go, Trey. This girl haven't even had the baby yet. And she's already the loser of talking about some mystery man. Hey, would you hold up? I'm coming. You heard about Sheba. You better get going. I got your Bathsheba. Listen, I think I heard my mom say something about, to my sister about women going through hard depression or something like that. Yeah, maybe that's what she's going through. Look, girl, I'm about tired of you. Hey. Oh. I can't believe you, Trey. Believe you. Yeah, you better leave, because I was getting ready to whoop this girl. Stank. Whatever. I can't believe him. Well, you can't say I didn't warn you. It hurts so bad seeing him with her. I know. I know. Did you hear how he was talking to me? Yeah, you sounded kind of crazy yourself. What about this Mr. Man? Oh, I didn't tell you? No, I was beginning to think you were the loser. Really, Mimi? Yeah. Okay, we'll see this mystery man came right. Mm -hmm.